How to turn your Subaru into a gas pump. When you live in the middle of nowhere and there's no gas stations in your town, you need gas. So you got to get it from your car. And you might recognize this car. It's the one that whacked the deer. Like, oh, Pat fixed that car. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get that video up yet. But we're here to figure out how to get gas out of the car. I got my little spigot here and how this works is with Subarus it's really easy you've got your fuel filter here and that's your line in going into the motor and it goes into your fuel rail and then you have a return line which is below this and comes out and goes right around down through here and right back well you tap into that line right here the line comes here and to here like a like a straight away and I just put the big sleeve over top of it so it don't bump into nothing. But it's right here. And I cut it and I put a T in and came across here and I put a little valve in. And this return line, when your engine's running, it runs the excess fuel back into the tank. So what it does is when you open the valve, path of least resistance, instead of going back into the tank, it goes... And into my little tank. That's how I get gas. Let me show you. <clears throat> okay. Here we are in real time. There's no fuel coming out. As you see. I'm going to... Turn a little, I'll do, there we go, turn a little valve, now you got all sorts of gas running out, takes about, I don't know, I'm, I'm guessing less than a minute for a gallon of gas to come out and fill up, but if you need gas for your chainsaw or something, it's a nice way to go, and how I ended up doing it was, after the valve, put a rubber hose on and then a steel line the transmission line off the Ford and I hooked it around the front of the battery just make sure it had a bend in it so it could hook onto the can and it fills up the can pretty quick I guess it's about well, more than a quart it's gone through so it might take two minutes to fill a gallon of gas but when you need gas you need gas and this is a good inexpensive way of doing it or so I think. Yeah, I would definitely say it takes two minutes or so to fill up a gallon of gas. One thing you don't want to do is you don't want to tap in to your fuel line itself. Here. Because then you'll have low pressure going into your injectors and you'll have an issue with it. You know, you, you could, but it's going to be a problem. Go with the return line. A lot better. Some return lines are made of steel and some are really hard to get to or in the back of the motor and stuff but this one is real easy and they should put this on every car you know chainsaw lawnmower gas you name it almost filled I'm guessing uh, probably about two minutes a gallon half a gallon a minute You just shut it off, and you're all done. Now I'll set this down over here, and this just sits like right in here. I just put it right down in there, and that's where it sits, right in front of the battery.